morning folks I hope you're doing well today is an adventure day so come with me Let's get some gas. Oh. oh boy, the gas price is getting ridiculously expensive. I don't know much about electric cars, but I might just get a Tesla if I can even afford one. This is crazy. All right, now we're back out on the road. We got about one hour drive to get to our location. Let's talk about roads in America just for a minute. I know, I know, some of you may already know America, they have all infrastructure roads. We all know that, right? But this is so interesting because most American choose road trips over most means of transportation. I'm talking about airplanes, train, and so forth. And not a good thing about driving in America is variety of roads. You get caught in traffic. Let's just say there was a car accident, right? Backing out of the traffic, but you have to be to, at a certain, to your destination at a certain time of the day. You could take an exit using an alternative road to make it to your location might still add a couple of extra miles to your trip but having alternatives makes it driving less stressful here in america god i love driving in these roads the delaware water gap encompasses nearly 70,000 acres of breathtaking scenery along 40 miles of the delaware river which winds through the appalachian mountains the park features waterfalls and many outdoor activities, including canoeing, hiking, biking, swimming, camping, cross-country skiing, fishing, and many more. And we are finally here. Now let's go for the adventure. This is where we are. This is the place.
this it's a quite of exercise oh man hiking comes with a lot of health benefits speaking of health benefits here in mount tammany they have blue trail that is a lot longer than a red trail as crazy as this may sound but i wouldn't recommend this red trail if you're going here for the first time and you've never hiked before because how rocky this mountain is you'll be surprised how many times i had to stop and try to figure out what my next few steps will be to be honest though i didn't really make it all the way to the top of the mountain the way i originally planned it before hiking maybe i need to hike more often and come back to challenge this trail so if you've never hiked before I wouldn't ask you not to come, but you should hike elsewhere multiple times preparing you for this hike before hiking this one. It could be really, really dangerous, and I mean it. Overall, I enjoyed the hike. I hoped at one point it would start getting warmer, at least to keep my fingers warm, since I wasn't prudent enough to bring my gloves. The longer we stayed, the colder it got. We decided to call off the hike, although I couldn't get over this amazing view of the mountain from up here. I ended up taking numerous pictures at this spot. I love the view so much that I even chose one picture for my thumbnail. This is awesome. What a wonderful day this was at Delaware Water Gap. This was amazing. Although I would have wanted to hike on Pennsylvania side, but for some reason we got to the, we took the road that takes you up there, but then it was, the road was blocked. We tried finding an alternative road to get up there. For some reason, we couldn't find it. The GPS kept taking us many different ways. We talked to local people. Some of them were not even from there because it was most businesses that were open. It's more of like a area where there isn't really a lot of people. So we ended up resetting the GPS while we were on the road and it took us to New Jersey side. So New Jersey shared this park with Pennsylvania. They can only get the view from New Jersey but the whole field you will have to be on Pennsylvania side but since we are already here we couldn't waste a day we I had to do and show this amazing park so thank you guys for tuning in and thank you guys for watching remember to hit the subscribe button turn on the notification icon for more videos like this and also give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it until the next one I'll talk to you guys later peace When I see this camera and I see the the the, EO, the EOS R, mm -hmm. I I like the EOS R body. Mm -hmm. I think it's more like for travelers, for mm -hmm. content creators. Mm -hmm. Like when I see this, it's professional, but it's showing me that oh, this is for everyone, like photographers you know like mm -hmm. like everybody else i agree oh it has this button what is that for is that for like flash oh yeah see that's what i'm saying it's got the built-in flash <clears throat> so when the microphone is not there it could actually press that on the photo mode it pops up and if it at night so wow mm -hmm. Yeah, the one is for everything. And 
the body is always on. Okay, I need to stop being. Um, I forgot you were recording. Too. Yeah, I was recording. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that's all. Never buy any more phones and just keep buying more cameras. 